Spring cleaning is here and Appalachian Wireless has the deal to get you started. Get a Samsung Galaxy S8 for a penny or a Galaxy S8 Plus for only $89.99 on the region's best network. Better service, bigger savings, that's today's Appalachian Wireless. Two-year agreement required. See store for details. There's a new set of eyes in the sky for the Pike County Emergency Management Office and it comes in the way of a new drone. And this one comes with all the bells and whistles. It has a lot of capabilities that our other drone doesn't have. One thing is it can fly in inclement weather, where the other one can't do that. It doesn't like the cold very well. Uh, the batteries get too cold to fly very long. Uh, the motors aren't sealed against rain and moisture. So the new one can fly in, in all kinds of weather. Tackett says their other drone only has one camera, where this one is equipped with both a high resolution and a thermal imaging camera. Uh, the other one you'd have to fly out and get your color video, and then if you needed infrared, you'd have to bring it back in, change the cameras, and send it back out again. And in the mountainous region we live in, a drone is an invaluable tool. There's a lot of territory that's just too dangerous to put people in, and especially sometimes at night. And this drone can fly with the infrared camera and see the heat signatures of people. And it is especially valuable when a situation is too dangerous for an actual first responder. If we have a tanker that spills some unknown hazardous chemical, we can fly the drone in, get the placard numbers off the tanker, and it can see the extent of the steel with the video that it sends back to us. And with the monitor attached to the controller, first responders will see exactly what the camera sees. As we can stream video or be able to from the drone all the way to the emergency operations center. So the people that need to make hard decisions can see what's going on firsthand. The new drone is a joint investment between the city of Pikeville, Pike County, and the city of Coal Run. In Pikeville, I'm Shannon Deskins, EKB News.